Hey guys, Matt from Mule here. I've got kind of a special video today. Um, so one of my favorite things about building guitars is meeting all the inspiring players and makers um, along the way while we do this work. And I met the Hampstead guys at NAMM show a couple years ago and they were great and they built amazing things. And so after the show, I had this idea. I sent them this steel baritone mule caster. Our steel baritone mule casters are a new sound. Um, and what I thought would be cool is for them to do what they do inspired by what we do. And that's this amp. Okay, this is their Artist 60 uh, tweaked by the things that they found inspiring in the baritone mule casters. And we're going to be selling these two um, instruments as a set uh, on the first. And uh, I'm going to have something on the website and describe how to go about doing that. But today I'm going to take you through the amp. I'm going to do some playing on all the different settings. And let me tell you first is that it's going to be really hard to replicate in recording how this amp makes me feel. I'm buying another one. I'm buying number two because I can't live without this sound. I've had this amp for about a month and I'm still tweaking things. I've never hooked a pedal up to this because I don't want to. It's never crossed my mind. It's, it, it's awesome. So um, hopefully I can convey some of that uh, through the recording and I'll take you through it now. So it's gorgeous. Take a second. Ooh. It's pretty as all get out. And we've got a bunch of knobs on here. Do all sorts of things. High and low gain channel, bright. This is three way, so dark, mid, bright, gain, bass, trouble. These turn these on and off for standard voicing. Uh, reverb and tremolo and master volume. Okay, and as if there aren't enough tonal possibilities on the front, we have the back. Okay, here's what we have going on on the back of the amp on off switch, mute switch, bias adjustment, but don't touch those things, just like truss rods. Just leave them alone. Just play your stuff, leave the knobs alone. Uh, output power, 7 watts, 20 watts, 60 watts. Every amp should be selectable like that, right? It's just, it's just the way. Okay. Uh, uh, speaker outputs, high and low gain switch on the back. See the high and low gain uh, channel on the front and the high and low gain switch on the back. So you have this huge range of uh, different options for gain, uh, voice level, and then reverb and trim order switch. So you have all these different things on this amp. You don't have to mess around with pedals and different amps for this and different it's all right here and it's amazing we're gonna get to playing it right now. okay let's get to some playing here this is on the low gain channel in the front with the low gain uh, switch on the back <laughs> sound that I absolutely love it it just it just sings it's not spiky it's not shrill it's very musical we're gonna go to the uh, highest gain setting on the low channel and yeah this is some other reverb and tremolo in it too, so. Gain 
settings, that's high channel on the front and high channel on the back. Obviously, just a really short overview. This video would be two hours long if I took you through all the sounds. I can't live without this amp. I'm buying number two, but you can buy number one on our website with this guy, this very baritone mule caster, muleofresophonic.com. How to buy a guitar. I'll have the link there. It'll give you directions on how to purchase it. Uh, go there right now. Okay, thanks for watching. Thank you.